It's Sybil Wilkes with What You Need to Know. Today, it's Friday, August 23rd, 2024. Number one, Thursday was perhaps the most significant day of Vice President Kamala Harris's professional life, accepting the Democratic Party's nomination for President of the United States. On our way to a speech of a lifetime that will be studied for decades to come, there was a careful lead up of politicians, civil rights leaders, and even family members explaining how to pronounce Auntie's name. In a beautiful weaving of the American quilt that Reverend Jesse J. Jackson spoke about 40 years ago. Vice President Harris told her audience who she is, a daughter of India and Jamaica, growing up in the United States in the flats of Oakland. Her work ethic and values that drive her and how she will present the case against her opponent and then how she will lead this country. Number two, NASA astronauts Butch Wilmore and Sonny Williams have been stranded on the ISS for nearly two months due to technical failures with Boeing Starliner spacecraft. Originally planned as an eight-day mission, it's now extended to almost 50 days, raising concerns about Boeing's engineering reliability. NASA and Boeing are working to ensure a safe return, though a re-entry date still has not been set. Number three, post-workout mistakes can undo your hard work, but they're easy to avoid. Skip the high-calorie treats and opt for water to rehydrate unless you've done intense training. Refuel with healthy snacks like nuts or protein shake to keep your metabolism running smoothly. Number four, Monique Brooks, a 49-year-old black trans woman, was fatally shot in an Orlando parking lot last month. She is the 22nd known trans individual to die via violently in the U.S. this year. Law enforcement is still searching for a suspect and her family urges the community to share any information to help bring justice. Number five, centuries after Harriet Tubman inspired many to seek freedom, she now inspires Harriet's Bookshop, a Black-owned business in Philadelphia. Owner Janine Cook transformed a consulting space into a thriving bookshop, raising funds through GoFundMe to purchase the building. Harriet's Bookshop has become a community hub, supporting Black women-owned businesses and expanding into more welcoming space. Here's your daily inspiration from Yogi's Jewels. Life is a series of choices. Let's choose to be honest, which leads to a clear conscience. I'm Sybil Wilkes. Be informed, be empowered.